And I don't wanna be lonely and when winter is freezing and trees start to bloat And I don't wanna be sitting alone in a room that's just filled with my soul And so I came to this place I'm looking for a familiar face and that's when I saw you Hello and welcome to Home Gap Shop. A portion of this video is kindly sponsored by Babbel. Do you think about the things we used to do? No, you couldn't. It's been exceptionally hot for this time of the day. So I hurried to the grocery shop for some vegetables. Washing veggies before organizing them in the fridge really helps save time. later when you're cooking i'm sure you'll be able to tell from the warm yellow hues throughout the day in this video that it has been quite hot <laughs> I thought of quickly putting some soaked dal to steam before getting into anything else. The breakfast recipe that I'm making today is not only healthy but also high in protein. Except for the time spent steaming, there is no actual cooking required. A quick cup of cold coffee sounded like such a wonderful way to beat the heat. I'll show you a fast method that doesn't require a blender or electric mixer to prepare coffee or rather dalgona coffee. To make this coffee, combine equal parts coffee and sugar or slightly less sugar if you prefer it that way. Then add just enough water so that the mixture turns sandy in texture not more than that then you have to whip it a little and in about 30 seconds the mixture will turn light in color now keep adding little water at a time while churning finally the mixture will be ready the more you whip it the lighter and paler it gets if this trick was of any use then please do let me know Air feels just like water. You're making me weak now. What doesn't kill you makes you. Our hands touch once. Or twice. Today was a holiday, so my idea was to make the breakfast slightly more interesting. It's nothing too much, but small changes here and there. I'm preparing these jars for the same use. Chopping a few veggies for the first breakfast recipe. Onion, peppers, tomatoes, cilantro and green chilies. Oh, I forgot to mention that the reason we are steaming our dal is because that makes sure that they don't get overcooked or mushy. Combining everything together along with a few spices that will be mentioned in the description box. You can choose to serve this recipe hot or even cold. Both ways this recipe tastes equally good. For the next recipe, grate carrots and cucumbers. And before I proceed with this recipe, let me take you back in time.
I prepared cream cheese using this method at home. Just a few pieces of paneer, a tablespoon of yogurt, a dash of salt, and that's it. I showed how I use this recipe to make a simple 2 minute snack in my last video as well. We are going to be using the same cream cheese today. You may recall that I wrapped some jute thread around the glass jars. Well, I'm going to use those to serve lentil or moong dal chaat. When finished, garnish with coriander and additional lime juice if desired. What do you think about chaat in a jar? I've had a lot of questions in the past on how to clean oil dispensers. A small amount of rice mixed with dish soap is one of the many options and tips available for cleaning them. Consider using baking soda as well if you have any on hand. Shake shake and your bottle should be clean if not wait a few more minutes before rinsing the soap solution in the bottle i like the time i picked you up outside of school said screw my dad i made my own rules it was easier than using baby oil or any kind of oil on top of steel surfaces to avoid fingerprints is another trick i learned recently and i was excited to test it out I cleaned the surface with a normal spray solution first and then applied that oil. It is said to make the surface shiny and spot free. When I need a break from my routine, I like to quickly grab a lesson from Babel. Well, if you're like me, living in a foreign land, then understanding the local language is very important especially for your day to day activities babel helped me start speaking a new language in around 3 weeks and now i like to take few minutes for a new lesson every day babel even offers you live classes and the best part is that it teaches real world conversations things a homemaker like me would need on day to day basis Choose from a variety of subscriptions and save 60% by clicking the link provided in the description box. Take me back to the take me back to those easy summer days when we stopped and It was time to dig into the delectable dishes I had prepared earlier. Spread the cream cheese and grated vegetables together on a piece of bread. To slightly alter the flavors, you can be creative and add mustard sauce or mayonnaise, ketchup or even just pepper. The concept of breakfast in a jar intrigued my husband and he even commented that we could take it with us to work on a day trip or to the park. We thought a little tamarind chutney might enhance the flavor of this dish. Of course that is entirely optional. I felt incredibly energized after breakfast. I had shared about this IKEA cabinet in an older video of mine 
and ever since then I've been using it in very many ways. To accommodate a wide variety of items, especially because I refuse to conform to conventional storage solutions or design aesthetics. The rule is whatever makes sense in my mind and floats my boat. If you're feeling down, pick a small area of your home and devote a little time and energy to cleaning it. It works wonders, I tell you. Today I decided to place my Dutch oven and a few small items from the kitchen over here. Since this cabinet sits beautifully next to the dining table, a few snack jars in it totally justify its position. Remember how I'd mentioned about the hot morning? Well, the weather had started to change a little bit and it seemed like rains were back. <laughs> I know it's already raining quite heavily back in parts of India and I totally miss the monsoon vibe over here. The special breakfast took the front seat today and so the basic home cleaning was kinda ignored. A brief vacuum, however, is a part of my daily schedule because frequent sessions lead to speedier work and a lower workload overall. It started getting dark and so the blinds were rolled up again. Winter is freezing and trees start to blow And I don't want to be sitting alone in a room That's just filled with my soul And so I came to this place I'm looking for a familiar The beauty of being a homemaker is the incredible variety of tasks one gets to perform and the freedom to do things according to one's own whims and fancies. Perhaps it's far simpler for us to do random things at random time zones if I may say so. Having said that, there is nothing quite like having a schedule or routine that fits your day and adds structure to it. Every day of my life has its own unique appeal and while they may all be routines, each one is slightly different from the last. And I can't think nothing better than starting a year with a drop of romance. Cause I came to this place looking for making delicious breakfast items, catching a sight of an Indian monsoon here in Berlin and then returning to a scorching summer heat together contributed to an outstanding day. Hope you also had fun with me today. Here's Home Gap Shop signing off. See you all next week.